My name is Mary Haas. I am a high school teacher in the Southern California area. I teach uh, chemistry at all levels and biotechnology. What is important to promote student agency is choice. Um, providing choices and options for students allows them to have um, voice in their own learning, which uh, I think ultimately then will promote their own success. Self-advocacy is something that is a, a lifelong skill um, and it's going to benefit them when, when that agency is coming from recognizing strengths and weaknesses. If they're advocating for what they enjoy, what they know they're good at and or acknowledging some of maybe what they could still work on but are interested in, that's going to help them to make good life choices. Um, in careers and in college and in pretty much hopefully all areas of their life. When they are involved in the learning process, they're engaged and it becomes more relevant for them and more important for them as well. And so that has been um, a huge difference in what I've seen happen in my classroom. Instead of looking at, say, if we have to accomplish a certain task, maybe not having just one form of assessment or one form of accomplishing that task, providing them different um, modalities, different alternatives for demonstrating their proficiency, for demonstrating their knowledge, um, is definitely a way that we can increase student agency because they're getting the ability to look and, and show what they know in different ways. Cognitive allows them to be able to explore on a larger scale what their interests are, what those strengths are, what those different ways of learning what they need to learn are.